Oh my god. Oh my god. That game scared me. That game literally scared me. God, thank God we got revenge on get against the Clippers. Thank God. But anyways, let's talk about this. What were my thoughts of this game? Well, I just wish Portland didn't blow that 15-point lead, to be quite honest with you. Second quarter, they stunk. Fourth quarter, out of nowhere. Third quarter, they kind of stunk, but hey, a <laughs> win's a win. Once again, we in the third quarter, they win it. Looks like it's a nice game on player stats. Damian Lillard with 39 points. CJ McCollum, 27 points. Nurk was somehow a shock. I mean, the 20 points doesn't shock me. It's the rebounding because I'm I. That's normally something I don't see from Nurk. Nurk is not a guy that would score or many points and not get that many rebounds. But the big three showed up, and you know. Harkless did decent. He did average. But you know what? I can't even be mad at that. Average players make average points. So keep dropping like this, Harkless, all the time. And we or a little bit better than we're good. And Nurk also got two takeaways. Two steals. Lillard had two steals and two takeaways. Lillard had, I mean, CJ had a takeaway. Also, Nurk had a block. Harkless had a block. A steal and a takeaway. And oh uh, my gosh, you know, we're gonna, I, I'm going to give the crit, the Clippers a lot of credit though. We'll give them a lot of credit. I mean, look at Tobias Harris, dude. I think he's an underrated player so far. And. You know, I think this Clipper team, like the other two, as you can see, they are over 20 points. The Clippers are ju are not a bad team. They're a s average team. They're an average, average basketball team that could make the playoffs. I mean, their bench didn't show up, though. And, I mean, their bench really didn't show up, except for Beverly and... Harold, they showed up, but everybody else, I was kind of surprised. Lasers were underdogs in this game. And, <clears throat> sorry. But yeah, it was a good win for the day for the Blazers to uh, beat the Clippers. And let's look at the other stats today. Uh, the Portland Trail Blazers were 55% on the field goals, 50% for the threes, compared to the Clippers 51% of field goals, and 37% for threes. Free throws, Portland slightly better, just slightly. Turnovers, the Blazers had 11 turnovers. That's it's better than 20. So, but they somewhat still played slightly better defense. They had four blocks, even though they got out rebound and out. They this is like I think, yeah, this is like one of the first games they been out rebound because they were one of the best rebounding teams in the NBA NBA five steals to look at the five steals 26 six assists and 27 assists and uh, really the Clippers did like I said and also 32 personal fouls on Portland compared to 23 but yeah the Blazers though They gave it what they got. The big, we'll show a lot of respect towards the Clippers. Because Clippers, they're not bad. <coughs> they're not a bad team. But are they a good enough team to make the playoffs, though? Uh, that's a, it's a hard question to think about that. Simply because, you know, it's no longer have that big three. And people... We're like, oh my goodness, it's the Clippers. They lost all the star power and all that. But, 
yeah, this give we gotta give the Clippers a lot of credit today. Gotta give them a lot of credit. They came to play. Harris is a pretty good small forward and a pretty good player. And hopefully we beat Memphis on Thursday. I believe it's Thursday that the Blazers are playing next. I could be wrong, but hopefully we win that one to get some payback. But once again, though, Portland just another third quarter a lead and a win. All their wins have been leading in the third quarter. All their losses have been leading, have been not leading in the third quarter. So really, when when is that gonna stop? You can't rely on leading in the third quarter every time. You can't rely on that to make the playoffs. If you do, if that's something you really rely, you gotta fix some things up. Now, Portland, I hope they get their bench players. Later on, like for example, Austin Rivers just got released from the Suns. Maybe if Portland gets him, I don't know how I feel about that. But you know, anything to help Portland. Hopefully, they make a trade like Brandon Ingram. There's been rumors of Brandon Ingram soon might get traded. I don't know if those rumors are true or not, but trade the trades they're gonna come soon, ladies and gentlemen. They will. They're about to come soon, so we'll see what happens. But yeah, next off, Memphis and Portland. I don't know if I'll be there, but maybe I will. Well, this was a good win. Good win. Lillard did outstanding. So did Nurk and CJ. Got good for Clippers. A lot of credit, though. Today, though, was a good day to be a Blazer.